tune. All right, let's get into this ad. Yeah, this is a uh, Fender Telecaster electric guitar, four hundred dollars, Carlsbad, California. This was uh, submitted by Ryan. That's uh, me. Um, it says hard to come by Fender Telecaster made in Mexico guitar with a custom chrome red finish and special Ford Mustang details. Only two hundred fifty of these special instruments were ever created and were put on display at specific Ford dealerships. This guitar is in immaculate condition and would be equally enjoyable on display in your home as it would be being played. It even has the original case candy and plastic protective cover over the black black pit guard. Cash only, please. Not interested in trades. Four hundred bucks. No low balls. How many Ford dealerships do you think there are? Because this was only in special, like specific Ford dealerships. You think there's many more than two hundred and fifty? <laughs> I have no idea. I bet there are more than two hundred and fifty, but it's like not much more. I bet well, there's figure, like three hundred and fifty max. You figure in the US. like every major city has one, right? And you know, I could be wrong. There could be thousands of Ford dealerships. Yeah. Now that I think about it. And so there's, you know, it's not like in our city, we probably have like four or five. At, at least. Yeah. So major cities get a couple because it's they're spread out across a wide, you know, piece of land, I guess. Apparently, uh, according to Google, <laughs> there are about 5,000 Ford what? dealerships. Damn, that was son. In, that was in 2003. So that was pre-crash. I, I will say that that is pre crash. Right. Um, but I found another article from 2017 that says that there's at least 3,000. That's a lot of Ford dealerships. It's out there selling cars so and like, trucks. Like I said, I imagine like during that economic collapse we had about 10 years ago, a lot of those dealerships oh, went, sure. out, went out. But, sure. Uh, well, let's talk about this guitar. Yeah. Obviously themed after the Mustang. Mm-hmm. But it's a Telecaster. Uh-huh. I, I'm sure the people at the auto dealership don't understand the confusion that would be caused to guitar people by that. Now, do you think a Mustang Telecaster would be a Mustang with Telecaster pickups or a Telecaster with a Fender Dynamic Vibrato? I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go with a Vibrato. I would want to see a Telecaster with the Mustang bridge and Vibrato on it. Would it still have Mustang pickups or would it have uh, the the Mustang, or would it have Telecaster pickups or Mustang pickups? It would be Nashville style, only it would just have the the Telecaster bridge pickup, and it would have two Mustang pickups. Okay, in the bridge and neck position. Um, I think I could get down with this. And it would have the little switches on the top part of the the pick guard. How would you do that with three pickups? You'd have to have what three? Would you have have three three switches? And they would give you maybe they wouldn't control the which pickups you have because you still have the tele control. No, two, but it would do the it would do the phasing. Two switches. Bridge pickup is always on. <laughs> I like the way you think. Uh, this is at its base. I mean, I have to admit, I like the the way this Telecaster looks. I recently bought a Telecaster that almost looks like this with yeah. the the red hot headstock and the red body. Uh, this breaks my rule of having the art be viewable while it's being played. Yeah, yeah. Because the there's got a big horse on it. Mm-hmm. I guess that's the, the type of horse is a Mustang. Well, that's the like the Mustang right. horse logo. There's a Mustang horse logo, and it is you know going horizontally across the butt end of the guitar because there's they should have made it an an, an emblem going with. Uh, the pick guard. It should have been on the pick uh, guard, yeah. much smaller, or it should have been an inlay on the neck. I like the idea of an inlay, but it's kind of like I think the ratios might have been off. The because te- they have the text Mustang written above the the uh, pick guard too. That should have been inlaid. Yeah, that would have been cool. And I think the the horse logo should have been um, some. I and I, I'd have to like mess with it. I'm thinking clear pick guard. Uh, expose mm. exposed wiring, so mm-hmm. you don't try to hide the wiring. But then you take that horse and you just make it like so it flows with the body, um, directionally. Right, and it's just under the pit guard, and you just see it. But it's like it'd be like you'd lose some of it to the bridge. Yeah, yeah, you'd lose some of the image to the to where the bridge is. It'd be partially covered, but it would be obvious. Like that's the Mustang. Like that's the I, Mustang logo. I would be fine having like most of the back end of the body cropped off 
and under like fitting underneath the neck pickup. And it's just like a hint of like, oh, there's the Mustang horse. It's just in there in the pit guard, you know? Yeah. Uh, I, I just think it's a really ugly design job of the placement of the graphics on this guitar. Otherwise, it's an attractive Telecaster. Um, I wonder if you could scrape off those graphics if they're like a, if they're screen printed on there or something or oh, if they are no. down in the finish. I don't know. Because for 400 bucks... If this is even a Mexican telly, it's pretty attractive for a Mexican telly. Yeah. that re- Just to have the red body with the matching headstock. Yeah. It's like a little Fender special run of colors. Is that a Rosewood fretboard? It looks, I believe so. I don't have any other pictures. Uh, someone asked recently, I think in the, in the topic poll, mm-hmm. uh, like they were like, hey, I just listened. Oh, it was on a post that they made on the group. Like, hey, I just listened to this episode way back in the day. And Ryan said he'd never buy another Telecaster again. But then he went and bought one. So what about that? <laughs> uh, I I think I'm going to say that I had a bad run with a couple Telecasters that I just didn't enjoy. And then I finally found one that I jive with. And uh, it looks like a classic Telecaster, but it doesn't really play like one, which is why I think I like it. Right, right. <laughs> Do we have anything else to say about uh, this guitar or this ad? Nope. What? Uh, here's a question. Yeah. Uh, if there was a Fender Mustang, mm-hmm. but you themed it after a different Ford, what would you theme it after? Um, this in, in this okay. in this in this premise, Steve has to remember all the Fords that there are. No, no, no. I have the answer. I don't know if this is still legit, uh, but my answer is it's a Fender Mustang, and uh, I would model it after the Jaguar XJ8. So a different, not a Ford, but a different car. Well, Ford owns Jaguar. Oh, okay. I don't, I didn't know that. So, or at least they did. I don't know if that, like I said, I don't know if that's still true. I just thought that would be like a really stupid technicality <laughs> to, like, to like ride. I like on. the idea of mixing animals between brands. Like you could do like a Mustang that's themed after a Dodge Viper. Like right. A horse and a snake together at last. Uh, what's another a, like a Ram, a Dodge Ram, mm. and a uh, and a Fender Jaguar, Ram, oh, Ram and a Jaguar together. Uh, Jaguar was o- was owned by Ford from 1990 to 2008. Why isn't there no a Jaguar themed Jaguar? It's so obvious. It's why, so why obvious. Not? All right. Well, I, feel I like don't know. What else would you? What? 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 what I mean, if it was a different Ford and it was a Mustang. And it had to be on a Fender Mustang, but it's a different Ford. Um, Focus. But that's the thing. It's like it's got to be something that's like worth it. (laughs) The obvious one. uh, Oh, and it writes itself. Oh, here we go. um, Is the Ford Bronco? The Bronco, which I don't actually think exists. I don't think they're currently being produced. Who cares? But that would be a a Bronco and a Mustang, two horses. Yeah. A double horse guitar. Yeah. I like that. The Ford Mustang Bronco. The Fo- Fender, the, the Mustang Fender Mustang Ford Bronco. The Fender Mustang Ford Bronco. Can we add another horse in there somehow? Is there another horse like business connection? That there we used make? to be the Ford Pinto. <laughs> That's a horse, right? Yeah. That's a kind of horse. No, it's totally a horse. I would totally rock a Pinto Mustang. And then you tap it on the, on the, on the butt end and fire shoots out of it. <laughs> Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, Ryan, you ready to get to that next ad? Yeah, let's.